Good evening, everyone. I'm Krista Gutierrez. When you think of an ice cream truck, you probably think catchy jingles and kids forking over their allowances. But instead of a push up pop, one customer told the ice cream man to stick them up. News 13's Alex Goldsmith has the story. Crystal, you can put this story in the category of what is this world coming to? It's the first day of December, but business is still brisk for ice cream truck driver Daniel Trujillo. There's no shortage of Klondike hungry customers. Friday afternoon, Trujillo was on his route near Dakota and Gibson, driving by a preschool when a customer flagged him down. An older looking man with a cane who was very curious. He asked me, he said, didn't, how much money did you make today? And I said, oh, I thank God I made a little bit and it's been fairly decent. But then the man, identified by police's 52 year old Ted Rael, turned serious. I'm going to tell you, he said, I have a gun and give me your money and you can leave. And I said, well, I didn't make that kind of money. And he looks at me, he said, well, give me what you made. Trujillo says Rael started reaching in his jacket. That's when Trujillo tried to drive away. The gentleman grabbed onto my truck trying to open my door. According to a criminal complaint, the would-be thief eventually gave up and ran into his nearby apartment. Trujillo called 911 and Albuquerque police found Rael soon after. He's charged with attempting to commit a felony. Not in my life I would, would think that driving an ice cream truck, you'd have to worry about somebody coming and robbing you. Trujillo has some words of advice for the would-be robber. Get a job, get a life. There's better things in life to do than try to rob an ice cream man. Trujillo says another man pulled a gun on him back in June demanding cash. Trujillo says he told me he hadn't made any money yet because he just started his route. When the man cocked his gun and threatened to shoot Trujillo, Trujillo told me he told that man, quote, you're going to have to start shooting because I don't have any money to give you, end quote. Back to you, Crystal. All right, thanks, Alex. Online court record show Rael has a thick criminal coding, a past including a string of DWI, shoplifting, and burglary charges dating back to the 1980s. 